Hey guys, welcome to this brand new house. We just completed building. Today's closing day, so we're here making the final touches. The guys just left fixing the last part of the gutters. Final little details. This is a serious day for this homeowner as they're moving in. We're so excited to bring you the Hedgemore. This floor plan features four bedroom plus a bonus, three full bathrooms, and it is just knocked out with hardwood floors, sh white shaker counters, or uh, cabinets, granite countertops, an amazing bathtub and tile shower that you're gonna see in the primary bedroom. Three of the bedrooms are on the first floor. So it's a great floor plan. We build it over and over again. You have one bedroom up with its own bathroom and the bonus room, which technically could be considered a fifth bedroom. Come on in, let's check it out together. All right, guys, so as we enter the home, we're in this open concept living room, kitchen, dining room area with a massive island that looks out into the entertaining area. So first of all, the kitchen, this is your gathering spot. This is where the kids are gonna do their homework, where you're gonna have meals, maybe a buffet set out for Thanksgiving dinner. You get your white shaker cabinets finished out above for an exhaust that actually exhausts out of the home. The tall, tall, 42 inch tall cabinets. Large drawers and lots of storage in this kitchen. Stainless steel appliances include the gooseneck faucet and double bowl sink. You can also cho choose from a single bowl sink. You've got your stainless Whirlpool dishwasher. Extremely functional, modern, and what everyone's looking for in this open concept area. As you enter from the garage, you have your bench and hooks, per perfect place to take off your dirty shoes, hang a book bag, or maybe store your winter coat on one of these hooks. Into the two car garage. So imagine if you came home, you'd park in, in the rain, you park in your garage, you come through, take off your raincoat, straight into the kitchen with your groceries. Perfect design. As we go this way, we have a pantry to our left, right by the kitchen, and a good size laundry room where you can shut the door and it won't be seen by your guests, or you have plenty of workspace. Upstairs, we're gonna have a large bonus room, game room, however you'd wanna use this. We've opened it up by putting a dormer in. So great bonus room here. Another bedroom and bath down that hallway. So the bonus room will come back down. Let's work our way past the kitchen and entertaining area into the primary bedroom. Primary bedroom is large. It includes a tray ceiling, recessed lighting, Large enough for a king size, any king size bed, two nightstands and a dresser. And then of course your primary bathroom, you have double sinks with granite countertops, upgraded lighting fixtures and an amazing tile shower. That tile shower on the other side, we have your five foot claw foot tub, modern claw foot tub. The toilet has its own room and then a large walk-in closet with plenty of shelving. Alrighty, so we'll make our way out of the primary suite back into the formal living area. Perfect for entertaining. Breakfast area, living room, eat-in kitchen. So now we're coming to the other side of the home, a split floor plan. Bedroom number one, very good size. Big enough for a queen size bed, two nightstands and a dresser, hardwood floors taking us to the bathroom that splits these two bedrooms. Again, granite countertops, tile showers and a tub. And then lastly, into the third bedroom on the first floor, and that makes up the entire uh, floor plan of the Hedgemore. 